What is going on everybody? I'm back making another video and in today's video we're playing a new game that I've never played on the channel before and this game is called Sword Warriors. This is actually like one of my favorite games on Roblox now. This is a pretty new game and it only has like 9,000 players so I'm hoping that it really blows up and they keep updating because this game really is a lot of fun. There's an endless mode coming soon and that I'm really excited about but in today's video I want to show you guys how to get your stats really high level in this game and there's quite a few different things that you can do so if you don't know how the game works pretty much what you do is you run over here and this is where you fight enemies you can do these dungeons with friends by the way you don't have to do it alone but yeah as you can see wave one take out a few enemies wave two you take out some more enemies and as you can see I'm already really good at the game so I don't need to do the starter world but that's pretty much how the game works and every round you complete you get gems and then you come and spend your gems to get better swords but there's a lot of small things that people don't really know that will increase your stats a lot so over here are the heroes and as you can see you get an equip bonus and an own bonus and every time you level the hero up both of these stats will go up so whenever I'm not even using these heroes over here they'll be giving me 25 extra critical points 26 extra speed points 29 extra damage points so you definitely want to level up all the heroes that you can get because all the heroes that you have unlocked will be giving you extra stats you just have to level them up to get a lot of extra stats also my favorite ornament to use is the slim balloon he heals you two percent of your total health every three seconds and then we're also going to unequip this guy this guy gives you extra xp but i don't want xp right now i'm going to use the two best guys in my opinion for getting to the highest round possible. So you're going to want the priest that heals you 1% of your health every one second. And then I also just use the swordsman. I feel like this is the best combo. So my ornament is healing me. One of my heroes is healing me. And then one of my heroes is just helping me do damage. So I'm going to go down to the final world. And yeah, here is the final world. Also, you can enchant stuff in the second world. So you're going to want to enchant a really bad sword until you get lucky level level six. If you're going to open up eggs, you're going to want a sword with lucky enchant because it actually increases your chances of hatching good swords out of an egg. Also, I don't know why these are eggs with swords in them. They should be like loot boxes or something. It's kind of weird that an egg has a sword in it. But yeah, as you can see, I've bought most of the game passes and I'm actually going to buy a few more. I really like this game and I hope you guys do too. If you guys do really like this game, make sure to hit the like button and comment down below because I'm spending a lot of Robux on this game. And if you guys really like this game, we get a ton of likes on this video i will buy this blade of the ruined king this is the best sword in the game by far and i will buy it but only if you guys really like this video because i don't want to spend a ton of robux on this sword for nothing also join my roblox group link in the description if you guys want to buy some merch and help me out okay so now that i have my luck sword on oh wait i didn't have my luck sword on let me put my luck sword on now that i have this on and i have all the lucky game passes we're gonna hatch the final egg and see if we can get a better sword so yeah let's hatch this egg a little bit ew a common that's not what i was looking for a common again okay come on no commons come on alexander sword oh come on we gotta get something better than the common and the rare really all right hatch another egg hey we got the epic the epic isn't bad we already have a couple of those so we should be able to combine them all right let's keep hatching we saved up quite a bit of diamonds here this took me a few days of overnight farming in the final world to get this many d diamonds so diamonds are actually really hard to get in this game okay so let's craft these great swords into a one star great sword and then let's craft it again okay so this still isn't as good as this robux sword that i bought this one right here so we got to keep hatching and try to get something even better okay we got another epic if we get like three more epics then we could combine all of them come on yeah we're not we're not getting exactly what we want here but it's okay okay another epic if, if we get two more epics then we can combine them all and the epic sword will be my new best sword 
All right, we got another one. We only need one more epic sword. Come on, please. Common, that's not what we want. Rare, come on. I can only open up two more eggs. Give me the epic. Yes. Okay, we got the epic. One last sword. Let's see what we get. And it's a common. Yikes. Okay, let's combine these epics. And now we have a three-star epic sword. So this is my new best sword. Let me craft all the rest of these also, just to get them out of the way. Okay, so this is everything that we have now. Let me put my new best sword on and I'm gonna see if I can enchant it. I might not be able to enchant it. Oh wait, the enchant area is in the third world, sorry. I said the second world. Oh wow, 162 million diamonds. Okay, well, I guess I'm not gonna be able to enchant this right now, but that's fine. Like I said, if you guys want me to buy this, I will, but only if we get a ton of likes on this video and you guys really like the video. All right, I'm gonna show you guys how to beat pretty much the whole game. I think I'm strong enough to beat the whole game. So for the first like 20 waves, I'm gonna just auto fight because I'm pretty much running like a tank class. I have so much healing and so much health that I can just auto farm for like the first 20 waves. Oh wait, there's one thing that I forgot to mention. Sorry. I already told you guys about how leveling up all the heroes increases your stats permanently, even when you're not using those heroes. But also, you're gonna wanna do this Drill Master guy. He'll keep giving you these tasks, and you gotta be higher and higher level every time. But as you can see, I've done 16 health tasks and 4 damage tasks. You get the health tasks like every 5 to 20 levels, but the damage task, you only get these like every 80 or 90 levels so make sure you're doing the drill master once you're a high enough level and that will also permanently increase your stats so yeah let's go back into the dungeon and i'll see you guys when i'm at like level 170 or 175 because i'm a pretty high level in this game and it doesn't even start getting hard at all until like wave 175 or 180 i really can't wait for them to add in the endless mode because i can run all the way to wave 200 pretty easily all by myself it'll be a ton of fun when they add in the endless wave areas. Alright, we're on wave 176 and we're finally starting to lose a little bit of health. So I'm gonna turn off the auto fight and we're gonna do this manually. Also, I like to use an auto clicker in this game to just swing for me. I'll turn the volume down a little bit because I'm just swinging over and over. Yeah, with 52,000 health, I just regen so fast. I feel like being a tank build in this game is kind of the way to go. I'd rather do less damage than have way less health health and re way less regeneration speed because the more health you have the faster you regenerate i'm level 419 i'm one level away from prestiging again i'm about to be prestige 45 i've been playing this game a lot the past few days like i said i really like this game i want to get on the leaderboards and i hope they keep updating and they add in that endless mode that says is coming soon because this game really is a lot of fun. Also, the best thing about leveling all your heroes up, especially the one that starts you 20 waves higher, is he gives you permanent speed upgrade. And you actually need a pretty good amount of speed in this game. I might not have enough speed upgrades right now. Obviously, the higher wave you get to, the faster the guys are going to be. You definitely want a decent amount of speed, but you don't want to have to waste all of your stat points on upgrading speed. So you definitely want to get all your heroes leveled up so that you get those free stats. You don't have to waste all your points on them. Like, as you can see, I'm not really fast enough to outrun these guys, so it's a good thing that I have a ton of health and a ton of regeneration, or I could have easily died there. Also, it's way easier to play with friends. This is actually kind of a struggle trying to get to wave 200 by myself, even though I'm a really high level. Man, I kind of wish I had that final sword right now. Yikes. Am I gonna lose? I might lose. I hope you guys show a lot of support on this video, because I want to keep making videos on this game, and I also want to buy that really Really good sword. So like I said, if you guys really like this game and you want to see me make more videos on it, this video does really well, then I'll make some more videos on the game and I'll also buy the best sword in the game. Yikes, I might not survive this. Use an ability quick. I might not be strong enough to go all the way to wave 200 by myself, especially with the way I'm playing. I need to quit hitting these enemies. I keep getting all the enemies to rush me at the same time and that's definitely not the best strategy. Yikes, I am pretty low health. I'm regening a lot of health, but it it's just not enough once you get to these really high waves. It's so much easier with teammates. Yeah, I think I'm not gonna survive much longer, unless I just let my hero
hero take this guy out by himself. Yeah, look, I'm not even fast enough to run away. I'm definitely gonna go get the hero upgraded that gives me speed upgrades because I don't wanna waste all my points on speed upgrades. Oh yeah, I messed up. I just grouped them all together. If I don't kill them all right now, they're definitely gonna take me out. Okay, we actually got through that. Yeah, so I could technically beat wave 200 all by myself if I literally just killed one enemy at a time, but that's gonna take forever. I wanna get better at the game and then I wanna speed run to wave 200 all by myself. So I'm gonna just back out. I'm not gonna be able to get all the way through wave 200 by myself. So yeah, let's go and enchant my sword. I wanna get a good enchant on this. Gym bonus level five. That is not that good of an enchant. Oh wait, I can only get one enchant on this? Oh, it's gotta be a higher tier sword to get multiple enchants. Okay, I guess that makes sense. Well, I guess this sword technically has more damage, but it can only get one enchant. Yeah, if you look at the leaderboard, there's actually quite a few leaderboards, but the main leaderboard I wanna get on is the one in the main area. Let me show you. This is the main leaderboard right here and it goes off of your level so this guy is the highest level in the game level 595 that's the leaderboard I want to go for so yeah like I said if you guys like this game you want to see me make some more videos just hit the like button and comment down below share this video if this video does really good like I said I will buy the blade of the ruined king pack and this is this is a really strong blade I'm gonna save up a ton of diamonds so that I can enchant it as well and in the meantime time, I'm gonna get back to farming. Hopefully I'll be near level 500 the next time I make another video on this game. I'm gonna just keep auto farming it every single night because I actually really like this game. So yeah, like I said, if you guys want to see me play more, make sure to hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe if you have not already. I'll see you all in the next one very soon. Peace out everybody. Spirit.